In today's video, we'll be discussing the important questions of engineering chemistry. So, coming to the first module, uh, first module has a standard trend in which uh, you can definitely find this question that is Nernst equation for single electrode potential and um, followed by that they can also ask a definition of free energy, entropy and cell potential uh, like those terms uh, and then uh, the other uh, important questions are construction and working of calomel electrode, yes this is important, working of glass electrode, yes this is important, difference between primary, secondary and reserve batteries, this is very easy, this is also important, working of lithium ion batteries, yes this is a must uh, ask question. The other questions can be reference electrode, what is reference electrode, yes uh, and uh, Explain the experimental method of determining pH using glass electrode, yes that can be asked or what is the advantage of lithium ion batteries in electric vehicles and construction of sodium ion batteries are a few important topics from module 1. Coming to module 2, module 2 has, module 2 has metal, metallic corrosion, this question is asked every year and electrochemical theory of corrosion at, uh, in iron and uh, types of corrosion in that differential metal corrosion and water line corrosion and uh, what is metal finishing, yes technological importance of metal finishing, electroless plating, electrode plating that is also important and uh, electro plating, electroless plating and uh, factors affecting the rate of collision, collision, this is a very easy question in which you can score um, 7, sometimes it is also asked for 10 marks so you can easily fetch marks here. So, coming to third module, third module uh, explain the synthesis and application of polyurethane, yes this is important, polyaniline definitely mechanism will be asked and uh, two size dependent properties of nanomaterials, yes, what are nanomaterials, synthesis of nanomaterials by Solgel uh, process, yes this is also important, note on fullerenes and uh, its applications, yes this is also important and polylactic acid, yes the properties application and synthesis of polylactic acid can also be asked and uh, what are polymer composites, Kev Kevlar fiber uh, is also another important question from this topic and they can also ask about graphene and uh, polyurethane also is important. Coming to fourth module, fourth module and fifth module are purely theoretical topics especially the fourth module in which you can easily fetch marks um, like uh, the important questions can be uh, example microwave synthesis and biocatalyst reaction, yes, synthesis of adipic acid, yes this is also important and working of methanol, uh, O2 fuel uh, cell, yes this is also important, hydrogen production from photocatalytic water splitting method, yes this is also important, synthesis of paracetamol by conventional and green root uh, from phenol, yes this is also important and this question is a must, photovoltaic cell, yes this is very important, you can also ask the basic principles of green chemistry, uh, biocatalyzed reactions and uh, sources effects and control of oxides of nitrogen and carbon. These questions were asked previous year and these questions were of 10 marks. So you should definitely look into these questions as well. Describe the solvent free reaction and mention its advantages. It is also important. Yes. Um, sources, effects and control of sulfur that can also be asked. Yes. Coming to fifth module. Fifth module uh, here it's mostly about the instrumentation part, so here they can ask the theory, instrumentation and applications of flame photometry, yes, principles and requirements of titrometric analysis, yes, determination of hard water of, uh, hardness of water by EDTM method, yes, molarity, molality difference, yes, and theory and instrumentation of potentiometer. Fifth model basically consists of uh, those topics which we have done in our uh, chemistry lab, so by going through our lab manual and the notes provided in our colleges, we can definitely uh, score uh, good marks in this and even the numericals in fifth module are very easy. So uh, I would definitely suggest to complete fourth module, fifth module and first module. Uh, even the second module is easy. So uh, you can easily score 80 plus marks in chemistry because there are limited number of topics in chemistry and uh, talking about the numerical part, numericals are of same trend. So uh, sometimes even the 
the even the numerical values of uh, the given numericals are repeated every year so by solving previous year numericals you can definitely score good marks thank you